It's April 18th. I got invited to come out up here to Waterloo to a little uh, little township that used to be here. Um, anyway, I got this really high signal. I'm doing two-tone Ferris. Granted, I would have found this in the other multi-conduct mode on the E-Track, but down in that little hole, if you can see it here, that would be a Civil War button. Or maybe a World War II button. Oh, let me get better light here. Oh, the shank, I think, just popped off. Or something. No, the shank looks like it's still there. It was attached to something else. Either way, that is awesome. When I get it cleaned up, I'll get better pictures of it. Alright, my two club buddies already left, and I'm hunting around over by where this old school used to be in the mid to late 1850s, but anyway. I'm pulling this weed out of this hole. It has a hole through it. It looked like it had been on a necklace or something. But yeah, it's drilled almost perfectly straight through. Pretty neat, 1950. Who knows, maybe I'll clean it up and put it on a smaller chain or something. <laughs> awesome. Hey guys, I'm out at the old church that have Derek and I have been to before. Um, got a weird signal and I've decided to dig it since normally there wouldn't be pull tabs out here and I actually ended up getting this really neat uh, pocket knife. It says recognition of services of the county farm bureau and it's got this nice finish to it i'm not sure exactly what kind of finish that is it could be plastic i don't know but either way when i wiped at it wiped up really clean Alrighty. hey guys it's been almost maybe a good 45 minutes since i have pocket knife Maybe longer, but anyway, got an iffy signal, but way down in this hole about seven, eight inches. So focus here. Indian head penny, I believe that's number five for the year. Yeah, it looks like it. Cool, I won't rub it anymore. But awesome. Maybe if I poke around a little bit more and go after some of these deeper targets, I'll get more coins. It's been about five or six minutes after that uh, Indian head penny. It'll focus. 1917 weedy, and it's actually pretty green. Oh, yeah. Not too bad. Awesome. Peel up here. Back at it. Trying to get a little tired and hungry, but anyway, down here in the bottom of this hole, that pulling out this little guy. Looks like it was some sort of, uh, I don't know if it's a ring. It looks like that there were some hinges to whatever it was, and it had some gold gilding on here. Either way, neat. Hey guys, Caleb here. Um, it's rainy out. I didn't want the rain to put a damper on my day, so I went down to the local old park here in Cedar Rapids, and anyway, I decided that, you know, I'm going to dig a lot of different signals. 
Um, anyway, at the bottom of this plug, I get this low tone. Decided to go for it. Then I got. I am not sure exactly what it could be. My camera will focus here. It looks like it could have been an earring or something of the sort. But the way it's cleaning up, I don't know if it's like gold plated. Whoops. I don't know if you really see the edge, but I'm not sure exactly what this could be. Whoops. Oh, no, I'll get it cleaned up and we'll figure it out. I wonder if it was like an earring or something at some point. Alright guys. Hi fellow detectors, it's Caleb. It's uh, April 25th. I'm out at the old practice ball field that's here. Um, anyway, got a decent signal. Kind of jumpy a little bit. Anyway, I'm not pulling out a wheat. And it happened to be a 1911. I was hoping for an S mint on there, making it semi key, but it wasn't. So I'll take it. See if I can find some more. Hey guys, Caleb here. I'm actually out of the old school. It's getting out right now. Anyway, got a really nice signal. It was about four inches, four or five inches down. I don't know if you can see it down there, but it's a silver dime. And I'm, looks like a Merc. Yeah, it's a Merc. I if I can knock some of the dirt off here. I'm gonna quit rubbing at it, but that's awesome. Is there a mint? No mint. Alright, guys. Whew! Hey, guys. Caleb. Still at that old school. Got a few signal down in this really rocky type dirt. I don't know if you can see it here. It says Church Award on it. I don't know what the third one says. There's a word right there in front of my finger. But anyway, it's a little button or a pin. Look in the back and see it. It's really neat. If I get it cleaned up, I'll get more pictures of it. Sweet. Oh boy, I got this really nice high tone. It was a big target, so I knew it wasn't going to be a coin. But I ended up pulling this. Um, I'm pretty sure this is illegal to carry. But no, it's a <laughs> reference, my glove. And that's the knife. Yeah. Who knows, if I clean it up, maybe it can be used and I could sharpen it later at my own house. <laughs> Wicked.